The old rugged cross is the most renowned of all modern gospel songs. It was sung publicly for the first time by a choir of five voices in Pokagon, Michigan on June 7, 1913. For years, it has occupied first place in surveys of gospel music, and its melody and theme can be heard in any part of the world wherever Christians gather. Dr. Bernard himself admits to the fact that the completion of the poem was a struggle. He carried the idea with him to the eastern seaboard, but it was not till he returned to Michigan that, in his words, the floodgates were opened. Each of the four verses unfolds the grand theme of the death of Christ on the cross, the central truth of the Christian faith. Through this song, Dr. Bernard has put into the mouths of countless millions the story of the cross, which to the Christian is a story most dear. Like Silent Night, it was first sung to the accompaniment of a guitar. Reverend and Mrs. Bostwick, who were the first to hear its strains, were compelled to say, God has given you a song that will never die. The song knows no established creed, belongs to no single church or denomination, arouses no debate or controversy. It does, however, sing in reverent beauty of the most tragic event and of the most glorious triumph the world has ever known. On a hill far away stood an old rugged cross the emblem of suffering and shame and i love that old cross where the dearest and best for a world of lost sinners was slain so i'll cherish the cross till my trophies at last I lay down I will cling to the old rugged cross and exchange it someday for a crown Yes, to the old rugged cross, I will ever be true. Its shame and reproach gladly bear. And then he'll call me someday to my home far away, where his glory forever I'll share. So I'll cherish the old rugged cross Till my trophies at last I lay down I will cling to the old rugged cross And exchange Someday 